Prime 2's Nathan Hyun also got to speak with the Spokane Symphony's music director and conductor who had the privilege of meeting the Queen. Nathan? Yeah, guys, James Lowe is a musical director and conductor for the Spokane Symphony. He comes to Spokane for about 20 weeks a year, but still resides in Scotland with his wife. He shared with me the time he once met the Queen and also his experiences of being able to meet her. With a whip of a baton, James Lowe conducts some of the best music in Spokane. Before coming to Spokane in 2019, his career has taken him around the globe. From Finland to Germany, he says he's been able to see the worldwide impact the Queen has had. She's been a constant in our lives. You know, very few people are alive who have not known her to be Queen. So it, it's a strange moment. I think we all, of course, knew it was going to happen at some point. But I feel a little bit like a kind of an anchor has, has been removed. You know, there's something constant in the world that's, that's, that's been taken away with her loss. Meeting the Queen was a memory Lowe will never forget. He described her as someone who truly cared for the people she was around. I met her at Holyrood Palace um, uh, in Edinburgh, and it was an amazing experience. What was remarkable was that everybody who was there, she had a conversation with everybody. It was only about 30 seconds long, but everybody she spoke to, she had something really intelligent to ask or say or talk about. And in that short time, she just connected with everybody. Even though Lowe is 4,000 miles away, he is proud to be a British citizen. He said he felt as though everyone in the United Kingdom had a deep connection with the Queen even if they didn't like the monarchy. And in my conversations with James, he said that he is excited for Prince Charles to now be king. He did say it would be an adjustment singing God Save the King instead of God Save the Queen for the British National Anthem. In the studio, Nathan Hyun, Krem 2 News.